Are you guys tired from being stuck at level 10, 20, 30, or 40? Well, in this video, I have found a solution to all your problems. I will teach you how to level up efficiently. I have already leveled up four characters to level 50 this season, even though I had a one-week break. So how did I do it? Let's find out. With the beginning of this season, a new pet got introduced, which you can get for free when you buy any number of fish tips. His unique skill allows you to get an 8% boost in experience. This is not always active, however. Every small amount of EXP counts. Secondly, when you are at lower level or anywhere before level 50, you should focus on equipment with the fate bound sets instead of the substats. You can watch how to build your class videos on YouTube, which will tell you the best fate bounds for your class. Here is another quick tip to increase your damage in early game. When choosing your primary class, choose the class with an attack first skill. For example, when choosing the assassin class, I started as a warrior, because his first is an attack still while the thief is just a dash. And make sure to upgrade your first skill to the max until you get some more levels. Do not feel scared to spend your coins on resting your skill points, as skills will play a major role in the early game. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, or else you will step on a Lego piece barefoot. Moving on to some game strategies. When you are playing, make sure you are always doing the highest level maps, as they will ensure that you keep leveling up at the fastest rate. I prefer to play the maps in this order, to ensure maximum efficiency. When you are trying to increase the difficult, there is only one criteria, which is to kill Valcolian leader. To achieve this, you must collect all the gems to open up the portal. You might have noticed that some gems spawn in different locations, so skip the maps that don't. This will save you some time. Even though it might just be one map. Overall, if you follow these tips, it will take you about 8 to 10 hours of grinding given that you don't get stuck at a level for long periods of time. For our final and extra tip in the early game, make sure to take advantage of the Valkyrie statues that spawn in game, as well as the cursed chests which will spawn extra mobs for you to get that EXP. As I said earlier, if you want to know about which fate bound to choose for your class, here are some of the classes that already covered. Have a great rest of your day. Now bye.